Welcome to our lecture online. Now here we're multiplying x to the 4 thirds power times the binomial. And the binomial contains, well, at least one rational exponent. So how do we do that? We use the same rules as before. We're going to use the distributive property by multiplying this times the first term and this times the second term, exactly like we normally do. So what does that look like? Well, this becomes equal to x to the 4 thirds power times x to the minus 2 power minus, because we have a minus here, x to the 4 thirds power times 5x to the 9 halves power. So I simply wrote it like that. That makes it a little bit easier to deal with. Now notice we're multiplying and the bases are the same. Now here you may say, well, well, the bases are not the same. Well, they are because this is the numerical coefficient which can be placed in the front. So this can be written as x to the 4 thirds plus a negative 2 exponent minus, put the 5 in front, x to the 4 thirds plus 9 over 2. All right, let's work that out and see what we get. Well, first of all, to, in order to add these two together, this needs to be in a fractional format with a 3 in the denominator. So we have to multiply the numerator and the denominator by 3. This is basically negative 2 over 1. So this can be written as x to the 4 thirds, and, well, let's re rewrite this 3 here, 4 thirds like this, and then the minus here becomes minus, and 2 times 3 is 6, 1 times 3 is 3, that would be 6 over 3, like this, minus 5 times x to the, notice we also need to have the same common denominator, which is in this case 6, so multiply the top and the bottom by 2, we get 8 over 6, plus multiply the top and the bottom by 3, we get 27 over 6. Now we have both of those fractional exponents with the same denominator. So this can be written as 4 minus 6, which is 2, x to the minus 2 thirds, minus 5 x to the 8 plus 27 is 35 over 6. And let's see here, 35, no, that cannot be simplified anymore, but this has a negative exponent, and we're instructed to write only positive exponents, so we'll bring it to the denominator, so this is 1 over x to the 2 thirds power, and that would be minus 5x to the 35 over 6 power, and that would then be the final format of our original problem, all worked out, multiplied out, and written with positive exponents only, and that is how it's done.